Um, well, one of the shoots you did, um, it, well, it, it is in Manchester, isn't it? It was the Foot Asylum shoot. So that, yeah, that one yeah. is, yeah, so that's the next image I was going to move on to. So that's, that was um, a recent one. Um, yeah, so with that one was, was, was that in there, that's, was that in their studio in Manchester? Yeah, I can't remember what the building was called, but it's that huge building where they have Foot Asylum, JD, and then like loads of Oh, the, uh, the Shark Project. Is I think so, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was huge. <laughs> I pulled up <laughs> to it, I was like, oh, okay. Um, but yeah, that was so exciting. But it took me four and a bit hours to get there. I had to go there the night before. Um, I stayed in a hotel. I stayed in such a nice hotel. I was like, so see, I'm not used to this at all, like this lifestyle. I'm a student. <laughs> I'm used to being poor and living from like toast. So they put me in such a nice hotel. And I've, I only stayed there for the one night. So I was, I was quite sad that I didn't get to stay in the hotel for longer. <laughs> but um I went there the night before and then it was a really start a really early start so I got to the set and it took so long for me to get my hair and makeup done because me and the makeup artist we just kept on waffling it was so funny because she was so nice and we could relate to like so many things that we both kind of experienced um and yeah, and like everyone on set was so nice. I had never worked there before. And I think I knew one of the photographers that were doing another shoot, like on the studio next to us. So I knew him off of Instagram. So when he walked in, you're like, oh, this is Elliot, by the way. But, oh, from Instagram. Hi. And then that's how I met them. And then I still have like all of the team. That I worked with on Instagram and they were so lovely and the photographer he was doing digital and film which was nice because I, I love seeing like the film whereas I prefer that to digital because I, I just find it cool um so that was really nice to work with them and it was it was a really chilled day to be fair like it was the campaign was like the cozy club so we were just cozy like the outfits were were comfortable the shoes were comfortable and everyone on set were just lovely so yeah was, was the type of shoot uh was it the same sort of thing as well with I mean because it comes across that in the images where it seems yeah really casual really relaxed and again as you're shooting was it just kind of that is it not really was it not really quick pace was it just more sort of no yeah. no we got the images so quick like we were meant to finish at five I think we finished at like half two three and we stopped for lunch so yeah <clears throat> it was really slow paced um because there was only three pairs of shoes that we needed to shoot but obviously each shoe had their own outfit um so the makeup was the same the makeup didn't need changing it was just the outfits and because me and the other model we kind of looked related <laughs> never met before <laughs> um yeah we were just we had like a nice interaction I guess a nice kind of connection so it wasn't like there was no friction or anything so they were like okay let's go we were just like lean on each other and it was just it felt comfortable which is what they wanted which is the theme of the campaign so I think because we were comfortable like me and the model together I think it was just really easy to get the pictures like that yeah how, how was it with working with another model as well was it do you find that does it help does it sort of say you felt like quite like relaxed because you both got on um do you find it's, it kind of helps with the shoot where you can sort of bounce off ideas with each other a bit and sort of poses um I think that's the only time that I've actually had to work with someone like because with the the sports no not sports direct pro direct it was <clears throat> sorry it was the group but it wasn't like we were interacting we were just next to each other mm -hmm. um but whereas with the foot asylum one we actually had to talk and like you know work together 
I think that was really nice because the model was really nice, but I've been to castings before, which have just completely thrown me off. Like I, I just, you never know what to expect with people because obviously everyone's trying to, you know, make it, let's say. So some people are nice, some people just genuinely don't care. Mm-hmm. So I'm always so scared to work with other models because obviously, especially if they've been in the industry for a lot longer or they have like a huge following, I'm just so scared because I'm so shy. Like they could be horrible to me and I'd be like, okay, thank you. (laughs) I just don't contradict. I'm like, yeah, okay, that's fine. Like I just, I don't know. I'm just so scared to have that experience because it just, one, you won't get, like the best out of the the shoot and like the image you'll be able to see it in the images and then I'd hate for the client to be like why what is this and then yeah but luckily I've, I've only had positive experiences um maybe not on castings but like working yeah I've only had positive experiences and that definitely makes a difference it makes the day go really fast to be fair <laughs>